Alrighty, welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's 3. The game came out yesterday and I am pretty excited for it, but at the same time I actually am absolutely terrified for it. So, here we go. Alright, recording now? Let's see what we got here. Scare your socks off. You turning actual relics. This little blah 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 stuff back. Okay then. Alright. Guess you can't move. Oh, never mind. Hey, hey, glad you came back for another oh. night. I promise His voice it'll is be now. a lot more interesting this time. His voice is the same. Some great new relics over the weekend. And we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you, then past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as... The security guard! So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out of the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a foxy head, which we think could be authentic. Wait, what? What happened to my game? Oh, please don't tell me. Oh, come on. It didn't crash. Hey, come on. What's going on? Yeah. This is... Nothing's going wrong here. <sighs> Got to restart this. Dread. Alright, let's try this again. I promise it'll it be a lot okay. more interesting this time. We found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, Hello? people will come in at the opposite end of the building and oh, work their you. way toward you, then past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll Hi. be starring as Maybe the boom boy. A security Please guard. Have a little bit word off. So not only Eat. will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything oh, or events. makes out of the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a foxy head, which we think could be authentic. Then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. Watch the fingers. Uh, <laughs> uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. But I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, if we don't have something really cool by next week, then we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but you know, like I said, this we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings said it was like an extra room that got boarded up or something like that. So we're going to take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right 
with the click of that blue button, uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. Uh, then over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. <laughs> so in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That, that, that's a real risk. Uh, the most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spokes, man. And if you let that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. I see. You can only have one vent sealed. Actually, see with that one. Can handle it like I'm kind of nervous right now. Where's the squeaky nose? I'm wondering. I really want to see that. I'll try this whole... Okay! Yeah! It's not long, it's just normal. It's that purple Freddy guy. Okay, looks like we'll finally see what he does. Uh, still following him. Is that the board? Maybe that's that board up room that guy was in there. Air. Oh boy. Thank you. 
assist mode to insert and turn firmly the hand crank provided by the manufacturer. Turning the crank will recoil and compress the animatronic part around the sides of the suit, providing room to climb inside. Please make sure the spring locks are fastened tight to ensure the animatronic devices remain fixed. We will cover this in more detail in tomorrow's session. Remember to smile, you are the face of Brady Fazbear's team. Theories is that he is like he is the killer because like when the Armtrox say that he will come back then well okay another thing I'm sorry it's gonna take off see so anyway I think he's the killer and the killer's the phone guy therefore he is the phone guy because like they keep saying that he will come back and the night for the first game they they killed the phone guy but then the Armtrox think that. It, that he came back because of you, so they th think you'll keep coming back. So, I, I you think that one? Uh, never mind. I think I, I know what's going on because it says the pearl guy lured the children to the back room so this is him luring the children and then once they get there he kills them. 
or at least that's what I think so far. Uh, hello, hello. Hi there. Uh, for today's lesson, we will There's be doing our training on proper seat handling techniques. When using an animatronic as a suit, please ensure that the animatronic parts are tightly compressed and fastened by the spring lock located around the inside of the suit. It may take a few moments to position your head and torso between these parts in a manner where you can move and speak. Try not to nudge or press against any of the spring locks inside the suit. Do not touch the spring locks at any time. Do not breathe on the spring locks, as moisture may loosen them and cause them to break loose. In the case that the spring locks come loose while you are wearing a suit, please try to maneuver away from populated areas before bleeding out, as do not ruin the customer experience. As always, if there is ever an emergency, please go to the designated safe room. Every location is built with one extra room that is not included in the digital map layout program for the animatronic or security system. This room is hidden to customers, invisible to animatronics, and is always off camera. As always, remember to smile for the safe. face of Freddy Fazbear's team. Come on. game with a horror game without knowing what's going on at first so so, so I'll play it later so bye bye